So buckle your chuckle belts and get ready to see some of the funniest nightclub entertainment in the world. You ever eat at Sambo's? <laughs> no matter what you order at Sambo's, you're going to get pancakes. <laughs> you can have a salad with thousand island dressing. Do you want pancakes with that? Welcome to Laughs Unlimited, Sacramento's premier comedy club. Tonight I want you to meet three of the funniest men in America. John Fox, Mike Farrell, and Mick Lazinski. All three are top-notch comedians. John Fox was the runner-up last year in the Los Angeles Laugh-Off Contest. Now, most of us can be pretty funny at one time or another, but why would somebody want to do this for a living? I think a lot of it has to do with, with ego, really. It's a real powerful feeling to stand in front of 500 people and to be in charge of them and have power over them with just words. And to look out there in an audience and see a guy sitting in a chair and say, I can make this guy fall out of his chair with four words. You know, it's a real, it, it's a real powerful feeling. Stand-up is, is a real science anyway. A lot of people don't realize that. A lot of people go to a bar, a family reunion, or a party, and they'd be like one person making everybody laugh, you know? But you put that same person up in front of 600 people that have just paid five bucks a head to get in and are drinking drinks in the security of the darkness with their friends, it doesn't take long for one of them to say, hey, Buster, tell a joke. Blind dates are scary, let's face it. I'm afraid of blind dates. I'm afraid you might open the door on a blind date, and there might be somebody back there that resembles Gloria Vanderbilt. She's a real schnauzer, isn't she? Hey, Gloria, put on a helmet, would 